Chapter 13 And Yahuwah spoke unto Musha, saying, Sanctify unto me all the firstborn, whatsoever opens the womb among the children of Yashreel, both of man and of beast, it is mine. And Musha said unto the people, Remember this day, in which ye came out from Mitzrayim, out of the house of bondage. For by strength of hand Yahuwah brought you out from this place. There shall no hamets be eaten. This day came ye out in the month of Abib, and it shall be when Yahuwah shall bring you into the land of the Canaanim, and the Hatim, and the Amarim, and the Habim, and the Yebusim, which he swore unto your fathers to give you, a land flowing with milk and honey, that you shall keep this service in this month. Seven days you shall eat matzah, and in the seven days shall be a feast to Yahuwah. Matzah shall be eaten seven days, and there shall no hamets be seen with you, neither shall there be leaven seen with you in all your quarters. And you shall show your son in that day, saying, This is done because of that which Yahuwah did unto me when I came forth out of Mitzrayim. And it shall be for a sign unto you upon your hand, and for a memorial between your eyes, that Yahuwah's Torah may be in your mouth. For with a strong hand has Yahuwah brought you out of Mitzrayim. You shall therefore guard this ordinance in his appointed time from year to year. And it shall be when Yahuwah shall bring you into the land of the Canaanim, as he swore unto you and to your fathers, and shall give it you, that you shall set apart unto you who are all that open the womb, and every first thing that comes of a beast which you have, the males shall be Yahuwah's. And every firstling of an ass you shall redeem with a lamb, and if you will not redeem it, then you shall break his neck, and all the firstborn of man among your children shall you redeem. And it shall be when your son asks you in this time to come, saying, What is this? That you shall say unto him, By strength of hand Yahuwah brought us out from Mitzrayim, from the house of bondage. And it came to pass, when Pharaoh would hardly let us go, that Yahuwah slew all the firstborn in the land of Mitzrayim, both the firstborn of man and the firstborn of beast. Therefore I sacrifice to Yahuwah all that opens the womb, being males, but all the firstborn of my children I redeem. And it shall be for a mark upon your hand, and for frontlets between your eyes, for by strength of hand Yahuwah brought us forth out of Mitzrayim. And it came to pass, when Pharaoh had let the people go, that Elua led them not through the way of the land of the Philistine, although that was near. For Elua said, Lest perchance the people repent when they see war, and they return to Mitzrayim. But Elua led the people about through the way of the wilderness of the Red Sea. And the children of Yashreel went up, harnessed out of the land of Mitzrayim. And Musha took the bones of Yosaf with him, for he had straightly sworn the children of Yashreel, saying, Elua will surely visit you, and he shall carry up my bones away hence with you. And they took their journey from Sukkoth and encamped in Etham, in the edge of the wilderness. And Yahuwah went before them by day in a pillar of a cloud to lead them the way, and by night in a pillar of fire to give them light, to go by day and night. He took not away the pillar of the cloud by day, or the pillar of fire by night from before the people.